So next, after you pull these levers, it'll come down. You have to pull it. Once it does that, if you need this step, press in this button and pull, pull that down. Get up here, there's your engine. You'll take this, you will twist this right here. So like right now I have it already twisted, but you'll twist it that way. You'll eventually put it right here on this. And start to twist it to make the top go up. And then you can look at your um, other fluids like right there is your coolant. This is the engine bay of this truck. It's all dirty. But those are the two things that you look in here. If you want to look, try to find any leaks you can. But to lower it back down, you just take this and just twist it. And then twist that again, and then it'll start lowering down. And then you take this, put it back in here. So if you don't have that, then kind of screw. You lift that back. Let's go over here. <clears throat> Look right there, you check the, make sure that the, you make sure that it's okay right there. And then hop around to the other side. And make sure your hydraulic is good. And transmission is in here. There's a little dipstick. You can check it. Your uh, battery is under this door. And what else? The window washer fluid. So if you run out of window washer fluid, you just open up this, lift it up, put it in that little tube. And that's pretty much it. I mean, you can check the fluids electronically, like pressing number one. It'll give you your coolant. Press number two. It'll give you transmission. Three hydraulics. Four brake. And then five year volts. And that's all right here. So you just press those buttons if you want to know that too. But I suggest you checking the fluids automatically by going in there and checking it. Instead of going by what the truck says. But that's just my opinion. That's just a short little rundown on how to check your fluids. If you want it on the Volvo A25G, and really any other Volvo rock truck, articulated truck, whatever you want to, whatever you're using out of the off road vehicles, they're pretty much the same. If they look like this, then that's how you check your fluids. Like I said, if you need to know anything, just let me know. I'll do my best to answer you.